Hey everyone, welcome to Soil Goddess. In today's video, let's see how to make an easy DIY fishing game for kids, which is really easy to make and interesting to play. For this, you will need a white chart. Take a white chart and draw sea creatures of your choice. If you don't have a white chart, you can just use the backside of your old invitation or anything any white stock card like this you can draw sea creatures of your imaginations or you can just google and see what all the sea creatures there is no particular number of uh, sea creatures uh, that you have to draw it can be a number of um, sea animals once you have drawn it just color it with a crayon or sketch uh, because uh, it should be colorful then only the kids will find it interesting to play this game so I'm just using uh, sketch to color this if you find it difficult to draw it you can just take a printout of all the sea creatures and can color it and use it for this game activity helps the kids to improve their focus and concentration as well as the kids will learn a lot of new sea animals and sea creatures by this activity. I'm just showing you step by step how I drew this because uh, it is not really a tough thing to draw all these uh, sea creatures because we are not drawing something very professional it is just a cartoon kind of thing so it is really easy to draw it just took me um, 10 minutes to draw all the sea creatures and color it personally like drawing a lot of things so I take this opportunity to draw and use rather than taking a print out so you can see in all my activities I drew everything personally so if you're not a person who likes drawing you can just go take a print out and you can use it for all the activities if you like drawing and if you are a beginner you can just follow my method of drawing it is really simple and easy yet looks uh, great for the kids so it is like uh, you can just follow my method and draw to make the game interesting i'm just using different colors but if you want to use the same color which in which the animal looks you can use it like if for turtle you can use the uh, green color and for sea star you can use orange color um, or you can just use like i do in different colors so once you have drawn and colored uh, the sea creatures you can just uh, cut it like this uh, don't you don't need it very accurately you can just cut like this and if you want it to be waterproof you can just stick cello tape on both the sides of the picture to make it a waterproof so that the, even if the children put it on the water nothing will happen so i have made a fish a jellyfish a sea star a stingray, a dolphin, a shark, a snail, a turtle, a crab, a seahorse, a whale and a octopus. You can just put it inside a spice box like this. If you don't have a spice box, you can just take a bowl and put all the sea creatures like this. So we are going to play this game with a magnet so some iron piece should be sticking to the uh, sea creatures so for that what we are going to do is this is the easiest method we are just going to uh, take a stapler and staple it like this so that some iron piece will be sticking to the uh, 
to all the uh, sea animals by this way we can catch the fishes the next step is take a magnet of any shape or size like this and tie a thread to it we are just going to play the fishing game like this you can just take it with the help of the magnet this might seem a little easy for the adults but it is really a challenging uh, game for the children because the magnet is already shaking because of the thread and the children has to focus and take the animal sea creatures and put it on the bowl and also by this way the um, children can learn new sea creatures uh but you can ask them to take ask them to take the turtle first then you can ask them to take the seahorse like that you can teach new animals so uh this um video is i think this video is uh, useful for you guys uh if so please subscribe to our channel and keep supporting soil goddess thanks for watching